No way viewers, back for another day, another video on a stinking hot day as usual in Australia. Um, f firstly, the what I'm about to try, I heard on a video. I didn't see it, he didn't show us the results, he just told us. And I want to see for myself. So I'm going to try it, and I thought you'd want to see as well. Now, when I was learning, and I watched hundreds of hours of videos, I, I came across the, the problem where most of the videos you couldn't believe what was said. Um, they either edit it so that they don't show the mistakes or they just cut straight to the end and you don't see every step. And then if you're trying to replicate it without knowing every step, you, you, it's, it's, it's a certain routine, you can't cut corners with this, you know. So I found it really hard or else there was videos where you couldn't understand what they were saying or they didn't talk at all and that annoys me. Silent movies went out hundreds of years ago. Um, if someone's that camera shy, they shouldn't be making videos if they can't talk. So, uh, I, I, I try and I hope I succeed in making my videos as explanatory and as clear and as understandable as possible. So, I'm going to try what I saw in this video, what I, what I heard the guy say. And we'll see. Now, I'll turn the camera around and show you. Alright, so if I can try and hold the camera at the same time, what I've got here is mouse pads from laptops. And I've been told, from what he said, that these are all 100% um, gold plated all over. All you have to do is take the green mask off. Well, that would be nice. Really nice, because if it's true, I need these for my next video. I've got a project in mind. Now, there's one of these here which is all gold on the back. Like that. So wouldn't it be nice if they're all like that, front and back? So what we're, doing, we're about to do is we're about to find out. Now, in here, in this pot, I've got some, uh, just water. And I'm going to use sodium hydroxide. Now, most of you guys would have a, gr a granule form or a powdered form. I've got a liquid form. I don't suppose it matters too much. Drain cleaner, make sure that it's sodium hydroxide, not sulfuric acid or anything else that they use for drains. Um, if I can get the lid off. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pour some in here. I'm not really sure how much, I'll just... About that looks right to me. I'll try that. There's another word for this is lye, and another word for this is caustic soda. So just the word caustic soda should tell you that this stuff's dangerous. I will be wearing gloves, um, and I suggest anyone that does this wears gloves too. And if the vapours, because wind's blowing that way at the moment, if the wind comes this way, then I'll stop until it changes because I haven't got a respirator, as you all know. Now this is going to have to heat up for a while and what, what you basically do is you cook these in there for, I'll drop it from up here, um, you cook them for a few minutes depending on the board, some take longer. This green mask usually comes off pretty easily. Uh, the blue mask I've noticed takes a bit longer. Black fibre boards, they can take a little while. And... Uh, it all just varies. It varies on how much acid you put in, and it varies on the, on the heat that you've got the liquid at. So, you know, I really hope they all turn out all green, uh, all gold. So I'm just going to leave them in there to cook for a bit. Now, if you've got one of those tiny little um, wire brushes on a handle, I don't know, I can't find one to show you. They're only about that long, and they've got a little wire head on them. Then that's really good if you can't have if you haven't got one of those then a toothbrush is fine something rigid if you can something that'll scrape this off but uh we'll get to that in a minute when it when it starts to cook just leave it there for five or ten minutes sometimes maybe 20 and we'll see okay so they've been in there for 15 minutes i've only been able to find one glove the other one was all perished and i don't have any more as i've mentioned in my videos before i donated all my safety gear to the hospital but that's no excuse um, should at least try wherever possible to 
do the right thing even if you just wait until you can get the stuff um, if I couldn't find this today then I would have bought because this is pretty bad stuff um, I've got a box coming as I've said before I just haven't turned up yet so what I'm going to have to do is just reach in with this hand and maybe use my left hand to use the toothbrush so I might have to go and get the tripod because I need two hands for this all right, I'll go I'll back in a minute. All right. Now, we'll find out if these are even ready yet. They may need a little bit longer. So, uh, not really working too well. It should be this way. That's better. Yeah, you can see it's starting to come off. See? And it's looking like they are fully gold plated at least so far see this stuff just brushes straight off this uh, acid's pretty pretty good stuff at doing this that last stubborn bit there needs a bit longer this side yep Try and get this in the camera and show you. It just brushes, brushes right off. Looking good. I don't know if you can see that in the light, but uh. These dark lines here, they're in the board itself. The green mask is coming off. Another one. Oh, look at that, just peels straight off. Looking good. This is perfect because uh, I've got a video in mind that I needed these if they were good, fully gold. So just a few stubborn bits on there that'll take a little bit longer. So hard one-handed. This one here, it's coming off slightly. The, do the top stuff's coming off, but there's still more underneath. So that'll take a bit longer. I'll just leave all this for another 10 minutes or so. Clearly it just needs that little bit longer. And we'll come back. Okay, so it's been another 15 minutes or so. And while I was waiting, I thought I might as well dig these out. This is, a, I think it's part of a cell phone board. So it's got the green fibre. I just want to see if these are all gold plated, but I don't think they would be. Um, and a bit of a thing, I've got some blue some mask to show you the difference between the blue and the green. And this one here, which is like a black fibre board. It'd be nice if that was also all gold. So we'll find out. But these obviously will take longer, so I'll put these in and do these last. I'll bring all that up here. I'll put these in the end here. Okay, so we'll carry on with what I was doing. You can see the, uh, a lot of the mask floating around in the water now, so it must have naturally come off. It's so tempting to just grab one with the other hand, but I can't. I hope my arm's not in the way of the camera here, I can't really see. Alright, so, yeah, this is all coming right off now. Notice I'm brushing away from me, rather than backwards and forwards, which could spray it on me. I can't emphasise enough, guys, how careful you need to be. I know that 
people are assuming based on my previous videos that I don't care about um, safety well that's wrong um, it's very very important and uh, there's a sticker in here which I forgot to take off so you can see there's still a bit of mask under the sticker and what I should have showed you guys before I started was on the back of these mouse pads there's a piece of plastic which is what you see when you're looking at them at the on the laptop you don't see the board here you see a bit of plastic stuck to it and that's got this gooey green mucky stuff on it um, st sticky stuff see that bit of mask there won't come off now until it's soaked for a bit so these are these plastic things that are stuck on um, they, they won't come off with acid you need to physically put the board in your hand and rub it and peel all the sticky stuff off if you try doing this with the sticky stuff on there it just won't work well this one's come up good and again there's another little sticker in the corner that I didn't realize was there Oh, this is all done this one here must have just done itself so these are fully gold plated so that one's done I'll leave that out here so, yeah most of these are all started doing themselves and I'll do that Now the wood is not overly hot, um, it's not boiling by any means, this hot plate I've got doesn't boil, it's got a thermostat in there, it keeps clicking off when it gets too hot, and uh, this just shows you that you don't need it to be really hot. Look at that, another sticker in the corner, but look how nice the board looks, beautiful. This is exactly what I needed. Although this one looks like copper. There's gold on the square, and then this looks like copper. So that one's not full golded. Bugger. You can tell when you look at the two of them together, the difference in color. It's got gold around the edges, but it's not gold in the middle. Interesting. good to know. You know this one's going to take a little bit longer it's being a little bit stubborn if you could get the water hotter then it will probably help so it's got some stubborn bits on there so that can go back in um, I've seen a couple of people doing this on videos and they tried putting these glass bowls onto flame and they broke or if they didn't break in a video it wasn't far off breaking they just don't like uh, flames but they're quite okay on a hot plate um, I've had these on there all day and I've had them as hot as this thing will go and uh, yeah, it really doesn't matter it doesn't doesn't care about the hot plate it just doesn't like flame So I'm not going to do the whole lot in real time because it'll boil you to tears. You got the gist of it anyway. Um, so I'll do the rest of these off camera and I'll show you when I'm done. Alrighty, I uh, came back out here about um, half an hour ago, probably a bit more, to carry on and the wind had stopped and all the vapours were coming towards me and I'm serious guys, you do not want to smell the stuff. Any of the acids that we use, you don't want to get breathe them in, all right? So I've got to start enforcing that and being safety conscious, all right? So I waited a while, now the breeze is picking back up. I don't know if you can see the vapors going that way. I'm all done except for this one piece. It's starting to bubble, but it's really taking its time. Like I said to you, some colors are harder to get off than others, all right? And I really want to see if that's gold plated all over, so I'm going to put that back in. So out of all the circuit boards that I brought out, remember I brought some out? Um, 
The other two were copper plated. Um, you can see that it has got gold lines on it, which is good, but they're gold uh, copper plated. These are all the mouse pads over here, and there are two copper plated ones. So this goes along with what I was saying about some videos not being factual. For the guy to turn around and say all mouse pads are gold plated is clearly wrong. Okay, he should have said most. I know it's only a small thing, but when you're learning and you get small errors, in fact, it's enough to throw you off. You know, if someone says you can do something but you can't, well then you're going to have wrong procedures and you're not going to get results. And this is where I was banging my head against the wall for months trying to get the facts. You, you, you watch so many videos and only a couple of them are truth and then you're trying to work out which is true which is not it's not until you get to know better that you know which is truth and which is not so i'm going to make the statement here saying that some are copper plated but most are gold so these ones are all gold as you can see they all look really nice and these will be in my next video now this part here Sorry about my finger in the way of the screen. I'm trying to hold the phone. It's got a cover on it. Right, so this black stuff on here, I did try with a knife to remove that before I put these in here. And it wasn't like a sticker. It didn't want to come off. And clearly there's mask underneath it. You can see the green underneath. So I don't know what the story is with that. Maybe it would have to go back in or something. But for the what I have planned on the next video, that's not going to matter. Um, there was a couple like that. Yeah, there's another one there but um the gold's underneath it which is what i want because what i've got planned it won't matter that'll come off okay so there's the results some are copper most are gold most circuit boards are gold um i don't have a black well this i don't know if this was a black fiber or a dark green i can't remember but i've tried black fiber in the past being told that black fiber were all gold plated yeah this is dark green and uh, it's starting to bubble, so I'll leave it in there. I've, I've tried dye and black fibre, um, being told that they were all solid gold plated, but I have had ones that were copper as well. All right, so there you have it, guys. Uh, there's the results. Thanks for watching. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please be safe, guys. I can't say this enough. I don't want to sound like a nearly Nancy, but... I've got to start promoting it because people are thinking I don't care about safety and that's not just not true if you're gonna muck around with this stuff at least know what you're doing try and get the right safety gear or at least if it's not the right safety gear it's some effort to be safe all right guys catch you on the next one